this is the greatest advice locked in a painting do you have a grandmother well i lost mine a few years ago when i met madhvi parik recently she told me things so simply just like my grandmother used to it's a painting about a goddess's character which actually is a human character uh, she is basically talking straight to you yeah your character it's a request to all the women in this country to stand up for yourself no matter what ma durga here is depicted as mahisa surumadhini she's in the middle of a fight by the way with a shape shifting demon who has taken the form of a buffalo a mahis and then shape shifts again to attack her yeah like before after round 1 and round 2 yeah and so mahisa sur vadhini is the form she takes where she defeats demons conceptual demons mind you they could be internal or external hell they could be your thoughts too your inner thoughts your dark inner thoughts and she's trying to say that they can come in any form and that what's important is to stand up for yourself and to have values and morals and ethics and have positivity and try to fight negativity your whole life because that's a fight worth fighting you'll see many pagan references the sun is smiling the moon the birds are flying over they're all saying yes to life <laughs> i'm not saying they're pro life but i'm saying they're celebrating madhvi parik is not interested in painting the goddesses with silky smooth hair and making them look externally and superficially pretty for you you know indian goddesses are usually curvy doe-eyed with benign smiles it's as if they've just stepped out of some celestial beauty pageant but this painting does not have the same utility again this is a painting of a character every woman should aspire to have independence self awareness honesty intelligence passion confidence emotional intelligence self respect self discipline and optimism i mean i i googled it honestly <laughs> here she is stamping upon this hapless fellow i'm sure he deserved it well doesn't he no okay quick trivia shiva created her face vishnu her arms brahma said i'll give the legs agni presented her with the sadagni the weapon that could kill thousands vayu gave her a bow with an endless supply of arrows indra gave her a thunderbolt just like his twashta gave her the kamodaki the divine mace vishwakarma gave her an axe yama a staff kuber <laughs> he gave her a cup of wine she can handle it oh yeah for sure she doesn't need anyone's help but here in yellow is her trusty vahan the lion he has the face of a man but he he's a lion just, just trust me the composition is filled with strange and fantastical features look at this guy with his fangs and horns and a different creature trapped in each section of his body look at this guy three legs and 14 arms wow thank god he's not fighting <laughs> the fight between good and evil in this painting is the reason we celebrate durga puja on navratri festivals of india that celebrate feminine energy you know dandiya garba yeah that one my favorite festival by the way it's amazing don't judge me <laughs> oh and by the way spoiler alert she wins please subscribe to this channel like comment and share this to all the indians that didn't know the story thank you